This is a LexisNexis video tutorial using the Power Search form. This is a quick overview of the Power Search form. If you'd like more information about the topics shown here, look for more YouTube videos or search wiki.lexisnexis.com slash academic. The Power Search form is located in the General Searching section on LexisNexis Academic. Click the Power Search link to be taken there. The Power Search form is for more advanced searching. While most of your research can start on the Easy Search form, you will need the Power Search form to do more in depth searches. The most important feature that the Power Search form has is the ability to do a Terms and Connectors or Boolean search. A Terms and Connectors search will let you do things like search through a particular section of the newspaper, search by date, find articles that contain at least five occurrences of a word, things like that. The Easy Search form does the same thing as the Natural Language option here, so we will concentrate on the Terms and Connectors search in this video. If you'd like more information about Boolean searching, along with a list of all the different search strings you can potentially use, click on this orange help icon. This will take you to our product wiki. When searching, the first thing you should think about is, what type of content would I like to search? Do you have a specific publication that you need to search? Legal materials? Company information? Any source in LexisNexis Academic can be searched on the Power Search form. Let's look at the source selection. From here, you can search through large pre-selected group files, or you can type in the name of a publication here. For example, if you wanted to search the New York Times, it would pop up right here. Now let's try a search. I'll select Major World Publications, and you see as soon as I select a source, this Add Section search pops up. This is the essence of the Terms and Connectors search. This little box will help you construct your search. From here we will select terms such as HLEAD, which searches the headline and lead paragraph of each article. Today, let's search for articles about Hillary Clinton. Now, Hillary Clinton is often referred to as Hillary Rodham Clinton, so we will add in the W3 connector, which indicates Hillary within three words of Clinton and click the Add to Search button. Let's continue to use this box to narrow our search. We can enter in things like geographic location or city. Let's add Washington. You can also narrow your search to find longer articles by the length is less than, length is equal to, or length is greater than. I want a long article, so I'll write 700 in the box. That will give me articles that are longer than 700 words. The last thing you can do is take advantage of our LexisNexis at least function, which like I mentioned before, will bring back articles that contain a word or phrase that's mentioned at least five times. So we'll add and at least, and you can write five, you can write 10. Let's go with at least five occurrences of global warming. And that's our search string. Let's specify a date to narrow our results even further. I like using the previous six months. So here's our search. All you need to do is click this red search button to take you to the results set. 
and check out our other videos for a closer look at the different sections of this power search form.